Driving over there, Sal, no one would pick up the phone. I must have thrown 70 numbers out there, nothing. And then I got to the set of lights and I was like, oh, I'm talking to the wrong thing. I'm, I'm trying to call people who can help, who could help you with this? Mm -hmm. And I prayed at a set of lights and I heard very clearly, I have Tom, now go be Seamus's mother. Oh, that is a powerful message. Very. And my spiritual journey even solidified that. Coming this week on Feeling Sisters. Today's episode, I don't have a guest, I have a friend. We have Christine over here. She has so much things to share. It's so important for people to understand this is just life. Mm -hmm. Life is happening to you. Nothing special is happening to you, no matter how horrific mm -hmm. it is. It has happened to somebody else. This is life. You know, it's difficult. Um, you know, situations like this in you know in in, in you know for, to our loved ones, it's never easy. But you're here. You're doing amazing. You're in your growth. Tune in to new episodes of Feeling Sisters every Sunday on Eat, Read, Love. Hi, Sagis. Welcome to my channel. We're doing your reading. How are you? Let's begin. Make sure you do not check out the app. My secret app down there. Okay. <laughs> So, it's a little tease that we're doing. So, let's see what's going on with you guys. You and the other person. So, you can just choose which one. Okay. And we'll see where it goes. So, you can always flip it and reverse it. Okay. So, let's see what's going. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm So this is the first time that this card comes out. So it just means that you are experiencing what? Well, life-changing stuff, difficult things now. I feel like removal of things that you do not need anymore. Mm -hmm. The tower comes when the universe says that uh, you have to change. You gotta change. And whatever uh, resistance, which you, you do not, you know, uh, you do not resist change. You're very much go with the flow. Excuse me. So this is only a last minute thing. Like, it can be like purging energies that are still residue of something, of pain or situation. Okay? Like, Removal, removal, removal. Cleansing, cleansing. This is what I keep hearing with a tower. And this involves about, you know, a person also, of course. The person that you love. Being separated from them. This is clearing of path, clearing of energy. Mm -hmm. The magician and being able to manifest to manifest things in your life. There you go. People who resist change never grow. Because like a tree, it progress. It cannot resist it, right? A plant will grow, will blossom. And there are energies who are stubborn and does not understand that. Right? It can be the person that you're dealing with. The stubbornness does not prove anything. You will break down. You know. It's you against the universe. Mm -hmm. But it's not you. I'm talking about the opposite of you. You accept change. And that's why you're victorious. Mm -hmm. That's why you're victorious. Here we go. The Five of Cups. As you have manifested yourself fully with a magician, now you feel good. Because you have removed any kind of ties with that person. 
They're saddened about your change. Mm -hmm. The star card, their side. They have high hopes, very much, very very much. Mm -hmm. That you will work it out. Interesting how this turns out, Sag, because on their end, since they have the star and temperance, they're counting on you that this change that you're doing will lead you back to them. They're very, very hopeful. If there's anything that you're removing, they didn't see that it was them or their energy. They thought that you're doing some transformative things. And then once, because they see that you probably had the problem, like you got the issues. And as soon as you figure that out, you will come back to them. They didn't know that they were the issue that you were trying to get rid of. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Queen of Pentacles. You're taking care of, I mean, on their end, they are taking care whatever that they need to do first in their life, being responsible, which is good. So they're not going to be clingy. They're going to wait for divine timing with the star card. And then the temperance, uh, basically, um, they're going to meet you halfway whenever you're ready. Okay? Whenever you're ready. Okay. Now let's see. But they are, they're not going to give up on this. You get the Three of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. You're building your own happiness, which is good. That's where your focus is. Three of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. I aim to be happy and I deserve to be happy. And you're working on it. So very transformative, right? Very, very transformative. I like that. You get the King of Pentacles and the King of Wands can be same sex. Okay, so whatever genitalia you prefer. This is looking that this person sees that you are the one for them. They'll be able to make a move the moment that you're ready. So they know. They're not going to deny that you are destined. They basically know it's you. You're the one actually now who's doing this big change that I feel like I need and I deserve happiness somewhere else. You're the one who's doing that, not them. Makes sense. Hmm. Let me see here. Let's see. Seven of Wands. Eight of Pentacles and the Page of Cups. You being restrictive gave them time to sort their life. Eight of Pentacles, do what they need to do. Page of Cups is them. They still have feelings for you, but not enough to reach out. Mm -mm. Nope. On their end, Nine of Wands, Ace of Swords, Six of Wands. They're scared to talk to you because they feel this whole change that you have done to yourself, you're just going to ignore them. You're not going to... This is them trying to talk to you, but you will ignore them. And they're scared of that. If they do approach you, you also might ignore them. Eight of Pentacles. Because you have set up some boundaries. Seven of Wands with the Tower. Mm-hmm. Mm. So, it is showing here that the person will let you lead the way to reconcile, to make things work. 
you are the one who's go with the flow, then you're the one who can make it basically work. They do not want to reach out right now. They know it will trigger something in your end that will even prevent everything, all contact between the two of you to be over. Okay? So, I'm going to continue this reading. Link down there in the description box for the extended and everything that you need. And make sure you do not check the app down there. Never. It's a secret app. I'll see you guys again. Bye. Hi Sagis, welcome to my channel. We're doing your um dailies 29 to the 30th. Okay, so let's see what you guys have for me. Okay, have the chart, diamond spread. Um, so we'll see the points here. Okay, and the inner part of the diamond is in gonna be in the extended, and also the other part of the diamond. Um, this is a Venus spread, as the Venus is uh, represent uh, gemstone wise. It's a diamond. Here we go. Interesting. Diamonds are forever. Really, Venus? You tell me. Okay. That's the my check. <laughs> Here we go. For my Sanjis. Our Panicles, Justice card, Two of Cups, set Seven of Wands, the Devil. The good, the bad. Let's stay away from the ugly. I'm not judging ugly. There's nothing ugly in the world. Situations can become ugly, okay? Here we go. Let's begin. I'm packing up. That's one thing. I'm packing up. I'm taking my things. That's what they're saying. I don't know. You're moving, relocating, you're fixing something, meaning something is happening in your fourth house. You have the sun in Pisces in your fourth house right now. So, yeah. Spring cleaning. Definitely. <laughs> That's all I did. it. Sun is like highlighting, you're gonna see a lot of things in your house. That's not there, that's not there, that's not there. Because yeah. sun brings out, it, sun is a natural malefic, okay? Um, so it brings out the nasty in the house right now. It's like, hey, check, 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 give me this, give me that, okay? And fourth house. Fourth house is also, okay, your heart. So you see something disorganized with regards to your heart. Check, 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 let me take it out, let me take it out. Healing, healing, healing here. Uh -huh. So you're having some sort of um, heart chakra healing, okay? You're doing that. Um, and as far as the uh, unresolved, since K2 right now is transiting there, okay? So everybody gets their chance, okay? Regardless you have your natal one, you get your transit one also. So K2 unfinished business. So unfinished business with your baby data, if you have a Jupiter, because Jupiter is here right now, retrograde in your, um, you know, it's like now you're gonna finish it. Okay, I haven't finished with baby, baby data, let me finish it, okay? Saturn is here, it's been delayed, but since Jupiter is entering and Kate is here, come on, Saturn, let us finish this. And Saturn is just like, okay, I release control, finish it, okay? And then, you know, it's like, because Jupiter is going to be here for, you know, like 30 days. Finish it. Uh -huh. So you're trying to finish something here, at home, things that you haven't um, really put your attention in right now, you're doing it. Can be baby dada, got justice card. Divorce papers, the law, you know. Um, this is Venusian, okay, and we talked about Venus earlier. Unresolved matters of the heart. Uh, Venus is in your third house um, with uh, Mercury there. So, partnership that needs to be discussed is gonna be discussed. With logic, okay. Interesting because Libra, air sign, Venus is actually water because you know it's like Venus I believe uh, rules the apas it's called and that's water and Venus uh, you know it's like as far as um, um, as an as an energy we have how you know the body is I don't know 85 uh, 85 percent um, water so there's a lot of water um, I call that water retention no, I'm kidding. <laughs> so a lot of things about emotion and feelings is being communicated right now and it's coming out it's coming out it's coming out Oh, it's gonna come out. Yes, it's gonna come out. Address, address. Why is it emotion? It's just emotions. Two of cups. Uh -uh. Soulmate. Love, relationship, reciprocated. Mature energy of love. Meaning, the person that you're dealing with, let's talk about this. Yeah. They don't shy away from it. They're open to discuss. When you say let's discuss this, they're there. We like this. Especially here. It's in the top. Okay. You guys wanna see it? Uh, so that's a two of cups. Uh, 
Mercurial. Uh, let's talk. Let's talk. Let's talk about these feelings. This is what you guys are having. Let's talk about these feelings that we have. Other person or this is you. Seven of Wands. I love you. Can you be mine? We love each other. Can we be together? Because this is ownership. Seven of Wands for me is ownership, especially with the Justice card. Um, this is about owning because this is contract you know let's let's make it official let's you know you have done your work i have done mine let's make it official seven of wands interesting because a devil card is here was there toxic love between the two of you the person feels that because devil card for me lately has been an unfinished business. Okay. So it's showing here that there is a challenge on how you guys can work this. The big challenge here is you're trying to make it balance, but they're not. Okay. You're trying to make it work. But they're not, they are making it work, but on, a, on their own way. Okay. I feel like there can be lies, deception, and all this stuff also. Because you want true, honest love. And on their end, they have true, honest love with something on the side. It's like a wink-wink at the end. It's almost like it's in the fine line. It's just like, you know, well, you didn't say this. So this is a contract that you're signing up, basically, Sash. It's just like, be particular on the fine line, on the, you know, it's like, what was in, in the contract? You know, it's like, we make it official, yes, we're together. But you didn't say this, so I was doing that. Uh, so they want to claim innocence until proven guilty, you know? You know, like, this is a person like, yeah, we're official, we're together, but you didn't tell me not to talk, talk to my ex anymore. I thought that was, I thought that was cool. I thought that was cool, you know? I thought that was okay, you know, this is, this is, get, this end, end. like, if they can get away by having you, okay, and being with you, and still keep themselves, okay, with whatever shadiness the devil card is bringing, okay, in the dotted line, then they will get away with it, okay. So this is uh, a little bit uh, challenging, schemey wise yes, um, that's why you have a four of pentacles, you're trying to protect yourself from this one, and the truth is going to be told anyway. The person is very, very attached to you, okay, but we'll see in extended what more that this devil will show to us, okay. Uh, this is the tip of the iceberg, link down in the description box, the rest of the diamond, and what's in the inner part of it. I'll see you guys again, Sag. Bye. Apologize. Hermit with the page of pentacles, they have to explain themselves to you. Wheel of Fortune, it goes to your favor. Very surprised if you want what you deserve. You have to have some standards. Seven of Wands, the Star and Justice. There you go. You get